Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. The young and the restless spoilers hint at a new murder mystery on the horizon, one that could really shake things up in Geno City. Recently, a fire broke into the prison where Jordan was locked up. Since then, Jordan has disappeared. Fans are speculating whether Jordan might have caused the fire as a way to break free from prison. If that's the case, what if someone finds out and decides to go after her to put an end to her vendetta for good? And if they do, who could be the one to do it? Let's dive in and see what might unfold. If you have been keeping up with the latest drama, hold onto your seats because things are about to get even more intense with the mysterious disappearance of Jordan and the looming possibility of a murder mystery. For many months, Jordan has been causing a lot of trouble for the Newmans. The young and the restless spoilers suggest her presence has made everything chaotic in the once peaceful town. Just when the Newmans thought things would calm down with Jordan in jail, something unexpected happened. There was a fire at the prison where Jordan was held. This news shocked everyone in Geno City. The authorities are still figuring out what had happened, and no one knows for sure if Jordan survived the fire or not. However, Jordan is an expert in slipping through the cracks, so no one can predict what she might do next. But one thing is for sure, the Newmans are tired of dealing with her and want to get rid of her once and for all. So the young and the restless spoilers suggest if prison couldn't keep Jordan in check, maybe someone would take matters into their own hands. Speculations are running wild about who might be behind Jordan's death. First up on our list is Victoria, who is desperate to protect her daughter and her mother. So she might stand up for her loved ones and do whatever it takes to protect them, just like her family has in the past. Except for Victoria and Abby, everyone in their family has killed someone to protect themselves or someone they love. Since Jordan has been causing a lot of trouble for Victoria's daughter and mother, it's likely that Victoria will see Jordan as a threat and try to stop her. She might be ready to fight back and join her family in doing whatever it takes to keep their loved ones safe. Now, we wouldn't really put it past Victoria and Victor both to join hands and paint the town red with Jordan's blood. Jordan went after Nikki, and that is something that Victor cannot deal with. Could he be the one? But if neither of them take the action, maybe Nikki will. Lately, Nikki has been struggling to get her life on track. So there is a possibility that she might feel that getting rid of Jordan could be a step towards her freedom. But then again, how about the person killing Jordan comes out to be someone that no one saw coming? What if Cole ends up being the one? In the recent episode, Cole told Claire that as a dad, he has to keep her safe. Could he shoot his own aunt to protect his new daughter? We're just guessing about who might do it for now. But we'll be keeping a close eye on how things play out with Jordan so stick around to see what's coming up next. In the heart of Genoa City, where the wealthy and the troubled collide in a tumultuous dance of power and passion, there lies a mystery that has sent shockwaves through the community. The tranquil streets of this picturesque town have been painted red with the blood of one of its own, Jordan Devereaux. But in a place where secrets run deeper than the Mariana Trench and alliances shift like sand in a desert storm, the question remains, who could have committed such a heinous act? Jordan Devereaux was not just another face in the crowd. He was a man of many layers, each one more enigmatic than the last. As a renowned photographer, he captured the essence of Genoa City with his lens, immortalizing its beauty and its flaws in equal measure. But behind the facade of his artistic genius lurked a web of lies and deceit that would ultimately lead to his demise. The suspects are as diverse as the city itself, each one harboring their own motives and secrets. At the top of the list is none other than Victor Newman, the ruthless tycoon whose thirst for power knows no bounds. Could Jordan have stumbled upon information that threatened to topple Victor's empire, prompting him to silence the photographer for good? Then there's Chelsea Lawson, the master manipulator whose cunning knows no bounds. She shared a tumultuous history with Jordan, one marred by betrayal and revenge. Could Chelsea's thirst for vengeance have driven her to commit the ultimate act of betrayal? And what about Nick Newman, the golden boy with a heart of gold? Despite his noble intentions, Nick has been known to succumb to the darker impulses that lurk within us all. 
Could jealousy or rage have clouded his judgment, leading him to lash out in a moment of blind fury? As the investigation unfolds, shocking revelations come to light, turning the case on its head with each new twist and turn. From long-buried family secrets to clandestine affairs, the truth proves to be far more elusive than anyone could have imagined. But amidst the chaos and confusion, one thing remains certain. The residents of Genoa City will stop at nothing to uncover the truth behind Jordan's untimely demise. From the hallowed halls of the new and enterprises to the seedy underbelly of the city's criminal underworld, no stone will be left unturned in the quest for justice. In the end, however, the answers may lie closer to home than anyone ever dared to imagine. For in a town where everyone has something to hide, the line between friend and foe blurs with each passing day. And as the truth comes to light, it becomes painfully clear that in Geno City, no one is truly innocent. In the shadow of Jordan Devrox's tragic death, the residents of Geno City are left to grapple with the harsh realities of their own lives. For in a world where power and privilege reign supreme, the price of redemption may prove to be higher than anyone could have ever imagined. But amidst the chaos and despair, there is hope. For in the darkest of times, the bonds of love and friendship shine brightest, illuminating the path towards a brighter tomorrow. And as the sun sets on another day in Geno City, the promise of a new beginning looms on the horizon, offering hope to all who dare to dream. So, as the credits roll on another episode of The Young and the Restless, the residents of Geno City are left to pick up the pieces of their shattered lives knowing that no matter what the future may hold, they will always be bound together by the ties that bind them. And in the end, isn't that what truly matters most?